coming off the midweek draw in Toronto to, to advance to the court finals, the, the CONCACAF Champions League. How do you guys approach this game knowing that you're, you're trying to keep the legs fresh and, and also try and get three points? Yeah, it's a, it's a difficult balancing act as it has been really for the last month or month and a half. Um, for us, you know, I really feel really good about the fact that we qualified for the Champions League because now we feel like we can put all the focus uh, on the rest of the season trying to win the Supporters' Shield. We would love to do that, uh, and we're going to probably approach tomorrow night trying to play as many players our strongest lineup so that we can accomplish that task. We, had, again, still have to talk to the players and balance it with we don't want to risk injury to any of our players either just through fatigue. Yeah. It, does the surface here come into <coughs> Come into the equation just because it's a little harder to sure play. sure we have some players that have had some joint issues this year uh the two that come to mind right away are beckham and alave alave with his knee and beckham with his foot earlier this season so we have to make sure that both of those guys are are fresh and ready because again it's it's not that i'm overly concerned with just the surface but if you put a tired player on the surface i think it does increase your chances for injury with with Los Angeles ahead of you and, and FC Dallas behind you, you get concerns kind of both ways. How much is it just kind of focusing on what you guys need to do and not worrying about anything else that's, that's going on? That's all we can do. Uh, that's absolutely all we can do. I really feel like if we uh, take care of our own business, if we put the focus where it belongs, if we pay attention to the details, uh, I think we got a good shot. Um, but if we're going to be overly concerned with what other teams are doing or um, not going to be putting our best foot forward, then we got no chance. Mm -hmm. What do you expect to see out of New England uh, tomorrow night? Um, I think it's going to be a fired-up group. Uh, I've been in their shoes uh, on a couple of occasions uh, as a player, and once once you, you have that uh, playoff chance has gone by, now you're fighting for your job, and you know um, that when you don't make the playoffs, that's when a lot of changes tip, uh, tend to happen in teams, and uh, you know you've got to put your best foot forward in order to to try to stick around for another year. What's been kind of the, the secret for you guys to, to get some more results in the road this year and have a little bit of success there? I think we, we've matured a lot in the uh, last three years I've been on this team, just, just in terms of managing games on the road. Uh, you got to make sure that uh, you don't give anything up late in the games. I think the 70th minute comes along, and we seem to understand that it's time to lock things down, make sure we don't give anything up, and maybe we can get a chance there and, uh, and uh, get three points. Talk a little bit about... Uh the team changing its focus now from clinching the CONCACAF spot in the quarterfinals next February and now uh, refocusing on the supporter shield and getting the team ready for the playoffs. Yeah, definitely. I think, you know, getting that point in Toronto uh, was a big was a big step for this club, uh, especially, you know, with, with some couple games here left in the regular season. Uh, we can really try to make a run at the supporter shield now because uh, that's very important to us as well. Uh, so we can kind of switch mode a little bit and not have to concentrate on uh, – on CONCACAF for right now and just focus on getting, you know, getting results in league play. Speaking of league play, do you guys feel like uh, you're getting the proper respect as defending champions and as really uh, being the best team in this league over the long haul so far in 2010? Uh, you know, I don't really, to us, I don't think it really matters. Um, if, you know, I think that if you ask the players uh, on the different teams, I'm sure that they respect our team and that's what's important to us. Uh, you know, the media, um, you know, and the other outlets can kind of feel how they want. But at the same time, um, you know, it's a situation where uh, we're going to have to prove it again once in the playoffs. Um, last year was last year, and uh, we're focused on, you know, we're focused on winning another championship. Um, you know, and that's the goal here as we close out the regular season.